But I've completed the job. Uh, new front sprocket, uh, new rear sprocket, uh, the new O-ring RK chain, and uh, pretty happy with how the whole job went. Also fitted some new adjuster uh, gauges onto the rear axle as well. Uh, I had lost one at one stage. So yeah, the bike's getting ready now for the season. It's coming into the riding season for me. We're coming into summer now that we're in November. Uh, I've got no gas in it at the moment and I'll have to regas it all and um, and then I'll um, uh, change the oil and filter, freshen everything up so we're all set for the rides. It'll be some fast rides I hope. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Worked out pretty well. I had to take a few links out of course and uh, got plenty of adjustment there. I might even have to take another link out a little bit later on because surprisingly how far You've got to move the wheel back to get the chain about the right tightness. So yeah, fairly happy about that. Not a very big job to do. Uh, got the old CDX 200 there under the frame, uh, under the uh, under the cover there. Uh, probably get that, take that for a ride sometime in the next few weeks. So this bike's a 1990, it's the first one uh, with the rear disc brake, of course it's got a pro link, rear swing arm, and it goes really well. I've had no trouble with it in the many years that I've owned it, just basic maintenance. I haven't got the seat bolted on properly at the moment because I drained the tank. I'm running Pirelli Scorpions. I might put a new one on the front. Rear one seems to still be looking pretty good. But uh, yeah, in my opinion, this is an iconic dirt bike. Best Honda ever made. The best dirt bike Honda ever made. And I actually think the best dirt bike in 1990, that is for sure. In my opinion, it'll leave any other 1990 250cc dirt bike in the dust. These things are so tough. So, so tough. They're great for a novice and even an experienced rider to throw around on the trails. Anyway, I'm rambling. I just love that bike. So, uh, I'll sign off now and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much for watching. Hope this gets you off the couch and gets you motivated to uh, get your bike ready for the riding season ahead of us.